and what that looks like. And so I've decided that in my campaign, what I believe is really important is not talking about the power and the prestige and the position of being elected state vice chair. There are some people that will tell you this is all about a status symbol. 21 years in the military, I will tell you that I didn't always have an opportunity to be about a status symbol. It was about serving this country, and serving and preparing to die for this country. But first and foremost, it was about People always and our principles first. If we put our principles first and say people always, we're going to be doing some things in North Carolina. And that's what America is looking for. It's looking for a new sense of direction, a new sense of ownership. You know, it's hard to follow behind Chad and, of course, Congressman Taylor. Congressman Taylor has been serving as a public servant for the last 40 years. We talk about his reign as Congress, but he also served as a state representative in the state center out of Transylvania County. And I think as we look at the legacy of what he brings to the table and what we have to build in the future, we have to ask ourselves, what are we looking for? We've got to become technology set. We've got to be committed to technology. This isn't something that we can do in the past, and this is something that we can do when it's convenient for us. We have to recognize that we're dealing with multiple generations. We have baby boomers, we have X generation, we have generation X, the Y generation, and the new millennium generation. And each one communicates different, but what I'm finding on the campaign trail <laughs> what I'm finding on the campaign trail is that we all believe in the fundamental principles of our party. And that's what we have to get back to. I'm running because I want to make sure that we start reaching out to teenage Republicans. We have a lot of them. And we need to be talking about not just 2009 and 2010, but that presidential race. Because I'm tired of Barack Obama claiming Abraham Lincoln as if he's a Democrat. Yeah. <laughs>